I'm Dave McClelland. Welcome to my show reel. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Bugger me! She is pure evil. Where's he gone now? Oh, I don't know. Let's get back out in the open. It's too dangerous. Where did you learn your survival skills? I delivered mail in Newcastle when I first joined the service. The service? You mean the post service? Yeah, the postal service. <laughs> you made it sound like you were in the bloody SAS. No, I didn't. Yes, you did, you plonker. Do you want me to tell you or not? Yeah, all right, continue. When you first joined the service, did you have a number double No, you're just taking a piss. <laughs> yeah, it's brilliant. <laughs> I do have a number, actually. One, two, seven, four. All right, continue. When one, two, seven, four first joined the service. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> you on after me? Just pick a spot and get changed. It sounds like a right bunch. Right, go on then. Get yourself in there and shoot your pelvis and whatever else you got stuffed in there. <laughs> I'm uh, Alan from the Weather Gazette. Sorry, I'm late. Oh, well, I'm I'm, I'm uh, Steve. Uh, oh. Steve McDonald. I'm the owner of the Rovers. Oh. Hiya. Oh, I'm dead nervous. All of a sudden, I've never done a photo session before. Oh. Not with our clothes Any on. Any chance we can take these photos? Only I've got plans for New Year. Yeah, all right, mate. Steady on. Now let's all say cheese. 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 Like I told the police, I've never heard of this Stephanie Blake. Why would I be emailing her? We don't think you are. In fact, we're pretty sure it was your cellmate, Russell Lowry. But we think you helped him. No, no way. If I did something like that, I'd be thrown off the programme. That job's my ticket out of here. I won't risk it for Lowry. I didn't even like the blow. And what was it, Mr. Wilson? Bribery or blackmail? It was only meant to be the once. Eat whilst it's warm. Yeah, don't spend it on drugs. You know, all my male friends treat me dead nice, you know? Mm, bet they do. Why are you saying it like that for? Like what? Like that. Do you want me to suck you off, then? No. Why are you queer? No. What are you, then? I need to go. We lost a daughter your age not so long ago. What, so you want me to dress up like her? I think you'd better go. Come on. See you, then. <laughs> Any of those tricks? What have you been up to? Oh, not so good. Bottoms dropped out of this game with all this terrorism malarkey. I mean, do I look like one of them? Yeah. Leave it. I mean, last Tuesday, I'm driving home, two or three sawn offs in the boot. It's red hot and pissed with sweat. I have a shower, get out, towel round me head. Please kick me back doors in. Get on the floor, Mustafa! Anyway. I've got a safety debrief to do. Come on, you can't say that. See you in a bit, Clint. Someone looks busy. Yeah, I've got a lot. Night job, is it? No, I've just got to shift some rubbish, Margaret Dog. You'd be better with refuse sacks rather than tarpaulin. That's for a different job. Take out a store card, there's 20% off your first purchase. No, thanks. Oh, I need your name and address. Yeah, mate, just ring it through. Yeah, I'm. I'm in a rush. Sausage and tomato, uh, sausage and beans, uh, spam and egg, uh, two burgers and uh, two hot dogs with everything, and uh, oh, a can of Diet Cola. Do you want to talk, Ken? Donald's trying to get me first. He loves a bit of bonding. What's the damage, love? 